Join me today for a 20 minute indoor walking workout. We're going to get fit, build strength and work on our balance. Hi, I'm Shelley and welcome to Fabulous 50s. If you're new to Fabulous 50s, click subscribe and ring that bell for more videos created for women over 50. Doing this workout one or two times a week is really going to help you stay younger for longer because getting our balance right and developing the level of our balance as we get older is crucial. So I'm excited, let's get started. We're going to do 30 seconds of walking followed by 30 seconds of balance move mixed with cardio. This is going to be so much fun. You can either walk at the same pace as me or you can jog on the spot. And if you're new to balance exercises, make sure to have a chair close by so you can hold on to it to gain your balance. For your first move, put your hands on your hips, point your toe and raise your leg and back into centre. This workout was created just for you to keep in line with a government initiative to encourage older adults to do at least two balance improvement sessions per week as part of their workout routine. So mastering balance is equally as important as losing weight and building strength. We're going into 30 seconds of walking now and we're pacing ourselves. We're starting slow this time and we'll work our way up. And any time that we do balance training, we're going to help prevent falls, increase our mobility and increase our brain health. And that is going to keep us younger for longer. Change sides and we're doing the other leg now. Do the best you can, keep your balance and use a chair if you need to. Well done, you're doing such a great job. It's challenging, isn't it? Keep going, keep practicing, and you're going to get so good at this. Take your arms out in front of you, slightly tilt your torso and kick back. Use your glutes for the kicking action. Hold your core in tight and kick and squeeze your glutes. This is a great exercise for building strength and take it slow and do it on purpose. Great job. 30 seconds of walking, make sure you've got strong arms, tight abs and squeeze your glutes while you're marching and you're going to feel amazing at the end of this. Switch sides, take the other leg back and use your glutes to lift. It's a much different experience than using your legs to lift. And always remember to hold the core in tight because a strong core is responsible for our balance. Thirty seconds more of walking and we're going to slowly pick up the pace from here on in. Thirty 
Put your hands on your hips, balance on one leg, bring your knee up and back, up and back. Take this slow, do it on purpose, engage your core to lift your leg and hold onto a chair if you need the balance. This takes practice, but you're doing such a great job. Here's what I like. Jumping from a roof that is almost too high. Start walking. By now, you've signaled to the brain that you mean business and that you're working on your balance and that you're challenging yourself. Keep up the momentum. Swap legs, take it slow, and don't worry if you wobble, just straighten yourself up and keep going. Well done, start walking at 30 more seconds and take the time to acknowledge the mind-body connection that you're creating right now. This is the best possible way to reduce anxiety and to feel good. Stand on your tippy toes and take your arms back and forth. Stay for as long as you can and if you feel the need, go onto your heels and then back up again. If you want to really challenge yourself, close your eyes for a few seconds. It makes it way more intense. Strong arms, bring your belly button into your spine, hold everything in tight and march away. Stay with me, you're doing great. Take your foot and gently rest it on the floor, your ankle or your knee, depending on your level of balance. And when you feel confident, add the arms in and do the very best you can. And the goal here is to be better than you were yesterday. That's it. Start walking, we've got 30 more seconds. Keep the walking strong and fast. Change legs and you can practice raising your foot a little bit higher on your leg each time and then back down again. Just keep challenging yourself every day. Great job, 30 seconds of walking and there's only one way to increase your fitness and that's doing exactly what you're doing right now. So keep going and stay strong.
stand with your hands on your hips, slightly bent forward, balance on your right leg and bring your left knee up and back with a pointed toe. Take this at your own pace and keep that balance. Start walking, imagine the improvement your body's going to have if you keep up these balance exercises. It's kind of like you're taking your future into your own hands. It kind of feels like this. Change sides, keep the left leg very strong while you're moving your right leg in and out or with purpose. Keep those abs held in tight. Start walking or you can jog or dance, whatever you feel like, but the main goal for this workout is to feel good. Stand with your hands on your hips. One, two, hold. One, two, hold. The balance comes in when you hold, so do the best you can and keep going. It's time to think about three good things that have already happened to you today. And the gift of a body that is able to exercise could be one of them. They don't have to be big things, but you putting your attention on them will make them expand. Take your arms out wide, balance on your right leg and bring your toe into your ankle and back again. This kind of balance work trains the brain to know the precise position of the body and that's what keeps us from falling. Walk with your head high, your shoulders back, and be proud of yourself for exercising, for getting strong, getting fit, and getting healthy. Well done, keep going, let's do this. Swap legs, arms out, and focus on feeling good. Start walking, another 30 seconds, a strong body, strong arms, strong legs, keep going.
slightly bend your knees, stick your butt out, torso forward, take your arms out, up, out, forward, out, up, out, forward, and use those core muscles to balance. While you're walking, think about the words you've used today to describe yourself. Did you call yourself lazy, fat, useless, no good? Well, if you did, that is not okay. Let's describe who you are right now. You're active, you're energetic, you're full of life and full of vitality. So let's focus on that for the rest of the day. Interlock your hands above your head and take your left foot front, side, centre, front, side, centre. Keep your right leg straight and solid. Great job, 30 seconds more of walking. Keep those arms strong and your core held in tight. Change legs now, stand solid on your right leg and with the left leg, point front, side, centre. Great job. Start walking and keep up the momentum because this balance routine will be a gift for your body for many years to come. Take your arms out wide and we're going to repeat the same exercise but this time we're not going to put our foot on the floor. Use a chair if you need for balance and work your way up to mastering this. And don't worry if you wobble, the goal is to be better than you were before. Walking, we've got 30 seconds before we do the next leg. Change legs, use the chair for support if you need and do the very best you can. Remember who you are right now. You're active, energetic, full of life and full of vitality. Keep going, we're getting really close to the end.
take your arms out wide and take your left leg across your right and tap one, two, three, four, and back. One, two, three, four. Keep the balance in your right leg and keep your core held in tight and take it slow and on purpose. Start walking for 30 more seconds. Are you starting to notice the brain-body connection when you use balance? That's why it's so important to practice our balance because if we stop using it, we lose it. Swap sides, arms out wide, one, two, three, four, and back. One, two, three, four, and back. This is your last chance to put 100% effort in. If you've got the energy, do a light jog, run, dance, whatever you like. We're nearly finished. You've done such a great job. into a slightly seated position with your knees together and follow along with me as we stretch together. Not only have you done an amazing job at getting fit and staying healthy, you've given your body the gift of balance and that you will have for the rest of your life. Well done, you are amazing. That was such a good job and I really hope the balance work challenged you. Let me know in the comments below if it did. Please give a thumbs up if you enjoyed the workout and share it to a playlist so you can do it once or twice a week. And if you're really up for the challenge, click this video here and do an ab workout to tone and strengthen your core. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.